For album number 13, Lucy put 27 stickers in her notebook. She put three stickers on each page. Which number sentence can be used to find out how many pages Lucy put stickers on? We have the information, 27 stickers, three stickers per page. Well, we can just take a minute to write this out. Let's see, three stickers per page, 27 stickers total. So let's just draw the one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty one, twenty two, twenty three, twenty four, twenty five, twenty six, twenty seven. So this is twenty seven stickers total, and I've put them in groups of three for each page. And now we can actually just go ahead and count the number of pages because we know there's three on each page. So that's a page, that's a page, so is that. A page here, page here, page here, page, page, page. Let's count the pages. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, twenty-seven stickers, nine pages, three per page. That's what we have as far as all the information that we're given. Now we're looking at this. Which number sentence can be used to find out how many pages Lucy put stickers on? We know by our drawing it out and by our uh, reasoning out this three per page that there are nine pages. Let's look at the solutions here and see which one gives us nine pages. 27 divided by 3. Well, 27 divided by 3 actually is 9. That's actually the correct answer. Because if 9 is the missing number, and we put it here, 27 times 9 equals 3. Well, that doesn't make sense. 9 divided by 27 equals 3. Well, that's going to be a fraction, so that doesn't make sense. And 27 times 3 equals 9. Certainly not. That's much bigger than 9. So this is the right answer. Letter A.